But uh, guess what? California is lifting the mask ban. L.A. is going to hang in there for a little while longer because we're more densely populated. But uh, I can't wait for that day because I got to be honest with you. Now that I got now that I got the vid or the Kovi or whatever the cool kids, the DJs call it. Um, now that I have had it, I feel like invincible because I have the antibodies and I'm starting to act like those fucking anti-masker babies. I'm not wearing one into a store, man. I will never get over that. I will never get over what fucking babies so many adults acted like, you know. And this is coming from somebody who's, uh, you know, I mean, I'm all about childish behavior and not taking account for your own actions. <laughs> Quarantine. No. Stay six feet apart. No. Wear a mask. No. Here's a vaccine. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they all should have been wearing diapers. Um, whatever. But in the end, you know what's funny in the end? Is everybody, like themselves, will think that they did the right thing. I did the right thing. I listened to the news. <laughs> I listened... To, no, I listened to people who told me what was on the news, and I did that. And I'll tell you, I got away with it for a long time. I'll tell you, there is a world, you know, if we have another pandemic, right? If there's a new COVID, right? Because God knows Hollywood loves to reboot, and I think the CIA is the same way. You know, like, I think this was an experiment, this one. You know, they came up with the usual story. Uh... Somebody from another race fucked a monkey and, you know, and now we're all suffering. So it gave enough mouth breathers, you know, something to hate, right? Or ate a monkey or some shit. And I think, I think that we passed the test for mass extinction that the people at the top want. But I don't have a problem with that either. I really don't. I don't have a problem with the people at the top enact mass extinction on all of us because... The reality is, is that they're the ones that kept us alive. You know, they're the ones that feed us. They're the ones that tell us what to think. And, uh, and we do it. And I know you're listening and you probably think you're the guy thinking outside the box. Because you're on the internet. And you're talking to the real people. You're having the real truth conversations. Um, I love when people think they're having truthful conversations on the internet. Like, I'm getting down to the truth of this and they're going to enact some sort of fucking change while they discuss their plans publicly out in the open on the internet. Um, I mean, why would you do that? I mean, back in the day, you know, when people would have like military coups and shit, they, they didn't discuss it in public. And that's what you're doing when you're on the fucking internet. Oh, really, Bill? Is the internet a public place for everyone? We didn't know that. Could you talk down to us more? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? I'm just a man on the other side of an ice cream sandwich addiction just trying to figure out wh how he can pick up the pieces of his life. Um, and, uh, yeah, let's, uh, you know, I feel like we're coming out of the pandemic. COVID's just a cold now, right? It's finally just a cold and a sore throat, I believe. At least that was my experience with it. That was my fucking experience in day one. Shut up. Shut up. Colds don't kill fucking half a million goddamn people, all right? Whatever many, many fucking people. How many people died of COVID? Let's look that up here for a second. Let's see here. How many people died from COVID worldwide? What do you guys say? I say 1.2 million. And the number is 5.84 million. Oh, I was way under. Looks like I'm not winning the Death Showcase Showdown. <coughs> there was 450, 15 million cases of it, and 5.84 million of those people died. Now, let's see. How many people died from the common cold worldwide? Up to 650,000 people die of respiratory diseases. That's not it. Can you die from the common cold? Disease Bureau, climate change indicated. All right. 
You know what? I think if you sneezed really hard and you were near some formica and you hit your head maybe and then you came back and hit the back of your head and then fell down a flight of stairs and, uh, I don't know, and then rolled into a pit of fucking murderers, maybe then you could die. I don't, I don't know how it fucking works. All right, that's the podcast, everybody. If you're sitting here thinking, what did I just listen to? I didn't learn a fucking thing. That was a complete waste of time. That is the entire purpose of this podcast, and I feel like I've reached my goal. All right, that's it. I'll talk to you guys later. Have a great weekend, you cunts.